Hello and welcome to another video from Natasha Lee. Today I want to show you how to produce these DIY gel effect nails with gorgeous holographic glitter and some lovely silver studs to finish off the look. As always, full links to all the products used are in the description. And I'm going to begin by cleansing my nails with isopropyl alcohol. If you want to know my secrets for my long strong nails and also details on how to perform cuticle work and filing, there's a link in the top right corner. Apply base coat to your cleansed nails. I'm using a peel off base coat and once applied, allow to dry. Remember to keep any of the polish or base coat away from the skin around the nails, but if you do get any on, just remove it with a brush dipped in acetone or nail polish remover. You may have noticed me using this colour over a few tutorials and that's because I love it. And it's Morgan Taylor's Shock Therapy. It's the most amazing neon pinky purple. It's so beautiful to apply as well and the coverage is fantastic. The more Morgan Taylor polishes that I add to my collection, the more I'm absolutely falling in love with the brand and they are rapidly becoming one of my most favourite just for consistency, coverage and just because they're fantastic to apply. After applying your first coat, allow to dry and then go in with your second coat. Once your second coat is fully dry, I'm going to be using some nail foil glue and we're just going to apply this straight on top of the polish. Don't worry about the colour, it's perfectly normal for it to start off blue and then it dries clear. It's so you can see where you've applied it and actually it's a really clever idea. Apply carefully to all the nails making sure that you've covered all of the nail polish and then allow to dry. It really doesn't take long to dry as you can see from this time lapse. You do need to be patient enough to make sure that the foil glue is completely dry otherwise the next step won't work properly. And now I'm going to use another glitter from We Heart Nails. There is a review of the holographic ultra fine glitters in the top right corner and this one is Pinkies Polished. Simply dip a clean dry brush into the glitter and then stroke it over the top of the nail. Try to apply it in a stroking action to make sure that all the glitter flakes go nice and flat onto the nail to really bring out that holographic effect. Once you've made sure that you've covered all parts of the foil glue with the glitter, start to very briskly brush down in the same direction to push all the flakes flat and remove any of the excess glitter. This will give you a lovely smooth finish to top coat. Remove any excess foil glue that's dried using an orange wood stick or a cocktail stick and just push off the skin from around the nail. Now it's time to apply our top coat and I'm using the Glisten and Glow HK Girl Fast Drying Super Shiny Top Coat. Wow, that was a mouthful. Apply generously over the glitter. We are going to probably need to use, depending on the top coat that you use, three, maybe even four layers to get that super glossy, completely flat finish, but it is worth it, I promise. Once your first layer is dry, you can see the texture starting to show back through. So go in with your next layer of polish and apply to all the nails and then allow to dry. I actually applied four layers of top coat, so after the third we're going to get our studs ready to apply. And I'm going to be using some star studs and some simple little round studs. Simply apply your final layer of top coat to one nail at a time. And I'm going to apply these star studs to my ring finger and middle finger, as well as my thumb, and the single round studs to the little finger and index finger. Simply pick up the star and make sure you've got it the right way round, and then apply it onto the nail. Gently push it down into the wet polish to hold it in place. Then pick up your round stud and do the same. I'm applying these to my ring finger and my middle finger. Oh, I nearly forgot, and my thumb too. On my little finger and index finger, I'm just going to apply a single round stud. So apply your top coat to one finger at a time. And then simply apply the stud and gently push in. To add a little extra detailing, I'm just putting some top coat on a plastic back pad and using an orange wood stick, I'm just putting a dot of top coat in the middle of the star and then using a single SS5 Swarovski Rose Crystal AB, 
in the middle of it just to add a little more sparkle. Once your top coat is dry, it's time to apply your cuticle oil and I'm using the Simply Pure from Bliss Kiss and just apply it to the skin around the nail and then gently massage in. And here is the finished look. These nails remind me so much of the Gel 2 or Shellac Rockstar nails I used to do when I had my salon. And that's exactly the look that I was going for. I wanted that look that almost doesn't look like nail polish. These are so easy to wear and you can use any colour that you like. We Heart Nails has a whole range of the ultra fine holographic glitters and I do have a video review of them. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe for nail art tutorials every Saturday and every Wednesday I have my personal vlogs showing the real life behind YouTube.